Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our Rookie Balboa run where we're trying to beat the game on the hardest difficulty with nothing but rookies. And rookies it is. We are going into Operation Diamond Walker where we're finally trying to get some more Elarium, which we then in return need to build a Psylab, which we then in return need to train Psy Operators, which we cannot use in this run, but their rank will be high enough to allow us to then build a GTS and then upgrade the squad size. So a lot of steps until we get another rookie. And uh, in the meantime, we're just going to four men this whole campaign. Uh, Aaron and Jeranx with their freshly uh, freshly increased the bond level 2 will go into it we got uh, Saint Elliot and Sonar and we got our first Mimic Beacon so with that we really really got the best equipment that we could muster and uh, we're going to give it a go let's see how well this is going to turn out this is definitely not a runaway sort of mission we're all in and uh, need to get this uh, this beast-like uh, opposition diminished. Very good. Uh, so we landed. Let's give it a go. Central is, of course, trying to persuade us to hurry up, but there is no need to do that. We got some uh, limited high ground over here, which I think we should use. Position confirmed. All right. Bonus to aim when their bond med has attacked or is being attacked by the soldier's target. An extra bonus is granted if the bone, uh, bond mate is adjacent. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Putting both of... <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, putting both of the bond mates adjacent to one another. Got it. Got it. Moving. Everybody moves over here. Oh yeah, and there potentially will be loss, which is great. Beast-like creatures imply that we're very likely going to Moving see to faces ones berserks Moving to designated coordinates. maybe chrysalids which would not be fun at all but yeah either of those are fine Moving on target location. Position confirmed. even chrysalids might be fine we got one med kit so we can withstand a bit of their poison Good. We know that we're on high ground, they are on low ground. Apparently there are also losses in the in the region. Moving to designated position. Understood. Moving out. Moving to watch. Good, very good. This is the area where we need to go, but for now, Rolling. let's begin That's affirmative. to move up and try to spot out some of the enemies, really. Okay, so for the first time, enemies should spot one another. Yep. And the cool part about beasts is uh, this is melee versus melee. The poor uh, lost will not have a real chance. But he's doing his best. To engage them. I think we can lose our cover. Good. 
Good. Uh, I would say we're just going to Overwatch for now, because uh, those faces ones might as well just jump in, and we're also seeing a shoulder set. Okay. Nah. The bane of my existence, the assassin. Oh boy. Can summon stun monsters just to make it a bit worse. Will reduces, regenerates lost health is bad. Um, and takes increased damage of explosions, which we coincidentally do not have because we're not really, yeah, much of uh, much of a grenadier-ish spec. At least uh, she can be hit with overwatch shots. And spot it out. Oh wow, stun lancers have armor as well. Ah. This is getting better and better. Lots of hit points to chew through. In the meantime, the single lost is just being ignored. Great. Great. Fantastic. They're making a beeline very much in, into our direction. And the single lost just decides to also give it a go. Well. <laughs> Talking about great timing, right? Six points of damage at least, so that's a kill. I'll take it. We gotta kill the Advent Stun Lancer. Going to be one of the biggest problems that we're going to have for now let's reload and deal with the problems at hand namely the faceless ones here that's one down teamwork yes please all right ranks can finish this guy Aaron has the highest chance of hitting. Ninety six percent isn't bad. I mean, look, we can go to here. On my way. Okay, it's just getting better, and there is another pack right behind him that's a miss we're we'll trying that again we'll be trying that again all right come on well we got a mimic beacon which theoretically could be the solution but we're not that much under pressure yet rather kill the enemies Well, they die as warriors, as great a death as one could hope for. So, good news, I suppose. We killed two full packs. Bad news. Um, there are even more incoming. The Lost Swarm, however, here could be a help uh, for us. Because they can spot out the Chosen. The 
elders propose an exchange. Your lives, your resistance must end. And in return, this world is mine. Well, there you go, assassin. While you return to captivity, Commander, consider yourself lucky. You won't suffer long by my hand. We can't get uh, the we can't get the loot right there. This is the beginning of the end for your resistance. Could move over here though. Moving out. Ah, that would ha will help us with the berserk. Strength moves up as well. Starting to eliminate a couple of the dashers, and then hopefully the berserk. Not yet. We got a Mimic Beacon, which we could use. Potentially not the worst idea. One more Dasher goes down. And this might be a crit. Not quiet. Moving into cover, and let's kill the Berserk. So we're blocking the way for the loss. The Chosen doesn't really care about it, so might as well reload. Of course, we're seeing more enemies. And the Chosen decides to harbor wave the zombies? <laughs> Resisted. And killed uh, three of them. Well, that's a pity, isn't it? The dashers definitely are a problem. There are no two ways about it. There is no place you can run that I cannot reach. All right, AA run. One down. Two down. Uh, that could remove some of the tree, but not necessarily enough. We're definitely going in with the Mimic Beak in this turn. That's affirmative. At the same time, I'm wondering... Nope, not 100%, so we're not going to do it. Spreading out just a tiny bit. Oh, yeah. Can't really hit any of uh, those uh, things. Enemy eliminated. Getting rid of some of the chosen, uh, some of the lost. Uh, these two are still there, which is fine. 60% chance of hitting him. 
I think I'll take that to be entirely honest. Another 60% chance. It's as good as Overwatch, so might as well take it before the Overwatch forces you to take something else. And let's Mimic Beacon. Eighty percent, that's really good. You will fight and die as ordered. Oh well. Well, good news. Good news. Uh, the enemies are not stopping, so we got enough to kill. I was worried for a moment, for a brief second. The honed edge cuts deep. Okay. Well, good for us. As always, uh, the Chosen ignores the Mimic Beacon and now started with her little bit of a hit and run tactic. <clears throat> the end is coming. Okay, so where did she position her herself? She's right there. Let's apply some pressure. Shredded and extra damage. That's what I would like to see. Where is our med kit, by the way? Tracy Elliott doesn't have it. Ooh, I think I forgot the mad kid. Well, mm. gotta be a bit careful then. Roger that. Moving further back. And she's shell-shocked plus fully shredded, which is exactly what we would want to see. I think a Aaron, our best, our best shot, should stand here and make sure that we're not being completely overrun. Currently, we can still one-shot all of the losts. I want to stand in the open. Can we somehow get to her? I mean, look, she can hit us anyway, so might as well do this. I hate standing in the open. Well, this is a 40% chance for a crit. Didn't materialize in a crit, but we got a hair trigger. Even better, come on. There's the crit. And we gotta deal as much damage to her as humanly possible. In the meantime, they seem to be playing with one another, which is great. Explosion. Grenade. 
Three of you are blinded. Fantastic. <laughs> oh boy. More fun incoming. Damn it. All right. They got uh, the Bursa well surrounded. At least we're not the only ones suffering here. This world holds a great deal of promise. One must simply look past the current inhabitants. All right, let's kill one. Okay, good, good, good. And come on. She dodged the shot, okay. Just one shot in the chamber. Zero shots here. Okay, let's block this ladder. Now oh, we can do it with someone. Ah, uh, we can't do it with someone else. Well, we can do it with someone else. There's no further, Confirm. no further ranged enemy here. Let's get the dasher down first. Enemy We're enemy. again running out of beam here. And she's susceptible to to any form of um, any form of explosion. Ninety percent. Come on, let's whiff her. Yeah, there we go. Finally. Okay, that was a, a massively painful process. Chosen can be hurt. Now we just have to work on putting them down for good. Good. We're moving further back because, frankly, go. we got. We don't want to be the ones being attacked here. <laughs> Advent is missing the melee. Co um, uh, is losing the melee fight against the chosen. Uh, the loss. Against the Chosen, they are also losing, but... Very nice, even more damage. And they have surrounded uh, the Berserk, successfully so. burning and that means we need to hunker down otherwise we're going to die <laughs> good blocking the ladder Unbelievable. Orders confirmed. Moving out. 
Moving over. We're still very much surrounded. The losses are a double-edged sword. They are hurting us, but they are also hurting them. This here is going to be a problem. Hopefully the hunger down will help. Drinks. Ah, finally. Finally. Very good. Okay, so far so good. Kill Heading there now. Enemies down. I'm running low on ammo. Okay, so sonar Position moves up to here. Ranks, reloads, and overwatches. Overwatch. And I would like to close down this one here. Just so that the guy downstairs cannot move up. And we're going up against even more losses. That Berserker is absolutely surrounded. In the meantime, Ready to rock. Dead in the water here. A Aaron is trying his best to not be overrun as well. Enemy down. It's just a lot to take in with all of the losses. Time to clean house. Sonar moves down as well. We just gotta make sure we're not being completely overrun. Moves up, drinks, kind of stays back a little bit. I don't want one of the lo uh, the lost accidentally like running up to him. Four hits. That berserker is getting mauled to death in the meantime i think aaron here has a fantastic position just to wreck havoc Oh 
Oh yeah, that Berserker is going down very, very soon. Good, finally. It seems we're getting a better grip on that situation here. Moving, out. Moving up for some aim bonus. Berserker needs to die. And there we go. Not sure if the Holos are the only ones that are left now. I have seen a tower uh, as the Fog of War was slightly clearing. So that might be another, another thing to watch out. Oh boy. Aaron continues to massacre these guys. Good. Same as the frontliner again. Moving in. Drenks blocks the ladder over here. I don't want to be caught off guard. Overwatch, Overwatch, and Overwatch. And matter of fact, Overwatch. There's one lost down here. Moving in. And let's kill him. Okay, they, did that finally kill all of them? No. Apparently somewhere out there is someone that are still very much living and breathing. Can't believe that there is another pack. It seems more and more difficult. To just like push forward. Ah, so many enemies. Okay, that was another pack and I think if we kill them I could have been the last pack. Maybe the last pack actually was a pack of losts. So for now, let's just try to keep our position, kill all of the losts, and try to get that other pack down. I think that should conclude the mission. Okay, let's continue and get all of them down. Nice little reload, just the top of our ammunition. Back 
All right. I think we got one or two more enemies. But those are definitely from the newly spawned swarm. Yeah, three more from the swarm. Those two just need to move in at our direction. Three. And then we should be fine. It is unreal just how many enemies uh, there are. I was sort of embracing the idea of the Lost Swarms on all of the missions because they can be helpful. I figured, you know what, it's not that bad, but I might reconsider it. Maybe it is actually a bad dark event. Okay, finally. It was that one uh, Lost Pack that, uh, that was still keeping us busy. And yeah, the last one was a tower. Towers don't need to be killed, which is why I wasn't that excited to kind of move up. Wow, 70 enemies. Very good. This just goes to show that the chosen are vulnerable. 63 kills. Boy, oh boy, A. Aaron is the man of the hour. And we got Alarum Crystals, that's super important. And enough alloys, which is also important. Plus a couple of not so important stuff. But yeah, that was much needed. With all of the Alarium, Our work is proceeding as expected. we can hopefully soon research Alarium. And it might even, after the blue screen protocol, give us the option to get a, get a heavy suit. Because I could see how that can be helpful. Of course you want to typically get the war suit. But it's a bit of a trade-off between power now and just having shredding opportunities versus power in the future and having the optimal build. <clears throat> Very good. Blue screen protocol finally. So good. Got the blue screen rounds. Okay, so on a, on a rather serious note, uh, that would cost us 10 Alarum crystals. That's not the end of the world. For you, Commander. And now in terms of building items, two times blue screen rounds is exactly what we need. And we can build another Mimic Beacon, apparently. Yep, let's do that. We noticed early on that the Avenger had Great. To Great. Our equipment just got massively, um, got massively improved. of this research can only further our advances Commander. good three days for that or are we going for Ilarium, which uses holy moly 40 crystals um let's do that real quick I'll see that work begins immediately. and we need four more Ilarium crystals can we get that from the market no we have too little intel at this point. Good. Lightly damaged soldiers can be sent into combat. That's good. We need more intel. Let's check the black market real quick because sometimes you, uh, you can get something for cheap. But typically it's 45... Alarum crystals, yeah, 45. So we gotta get 45 to get the Alarum crystals. And 
and very, very soon we're going to be forced to invade here. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Precinct. Good old black side mission. But we got decent equipment, so we might as well pull it off. Oh, wow. No, 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 no. Show of force. I don't want to do that. And a protect the device mission. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Uh, that is likely... Wow, 122 intel. Hmm. It is the worst of all of the dark events to counter because the other ones are going to be worse, right? But... This here is only losts, and we get 122 intel. Eh, eh. That's sort of too appealing to just uh, not do it. I mean, we're fighting well against the losts, uh, and it is. I don't know. Maybe there there is still the chosen in there, but overall, it should be a relatively straightforward mission. 122 intel will go a long way. We can buy the Ilarium, essentially um, upgrade uh, or start Ilarium research next, which will then lead us to better weapons. And um, we could also then um, maybe start uh, expanding into South America. That's not a bad idea because uh, then we can get that instant um, that that instant uh, expansion may contact uh, instantly and that will save us a lot of time and will make our strategy layer so much easier so yeah a lot of things are going into our uh, into our direction but that will happen all hopefully in the next few episodes thanks for watching guys i appreciate your support leave a comment and a like down below and see you very soon bye bye